Hey, good people of North America and surrounding countries. I just got a really good shave. I'm going to finish off with some Floyd Genuine. Whew, man, the scent on this stuff is just out of this world. But this is not a shaving video. This video is uh, a review on the Scally Cap Company uh, Boston Scally Cap Company. Um, I've had a love affair with hats for a long time. And uh, I had a nice hat, and I don't know where the hell it went to. So I bought this hat. It's called the Black Rose. I bought it in size medium to large. When I first got it, I put it on, and it was just too big. It was just too big. And... Uh, I didn't want to return it because the return policy is like, okay, I got to pay for shipping back and I got to pay you to restock it. And if I get another hat, I got to pay shipping back to me. And it's just, it's just be better off just keeping the hat or giving it away, you know? So, so what I, but what I did with this hat here, and this is, this is a good thing. And if anyone buys a hat and doesn't fit right, if it's a little too big, you can stretch it if it's, if it's made out of cotton. But this one here was a little too large, right? So, and I measured all the way around 58 centimeters, which is like two and a quarter, uh, or I mean seven and a quarter in in American. Um, what I did though, see this right here? It's black, just, just a piece of weather stripping. And what I did is I cut a bevel in it so it fits down in the seam right here. So when I put it on, you can't tell that it's there. And it made a considerable difference. And I didn't have to pay any extra money. So they make stuff like this and they sell it for, for a profit. I just had to sit in my shed. So, but it has a nice fit. I can see it just a little bit, uh, but it's not really anything. Uh, I mean, I can see it, but... Uh, I wanted to alleviate that. I could just kind of come around some more and just make it all thinner. You know what I mean? Make it work better like that. But this is a nice hat. This is a sweet hat. I get a lot of attention with this hat. Uh, sometimes too much attention. But uh, I like it. This is this is an awesome hat. It's real sporty. And it's really classy looking. I do like that hat. So what I did next was... I went and I bought, I was looking for, I was looking at a particular hat that was sold out in my size. It was a trainer. And the reason I wanted that is because it's all cotton. This uh, black rose is a wool blend, which I'm not wearing out in the 100 degree weather, right? So I wanted, so I wanted the trainer. I never did come. It's like they never notified me. It's been like a month. And I kept looking, looking, looking. I just said, screw it. So I bought me another hat. It's also all cotton. This one's called the Pappy. And I think it's pretty cool. I bought this one in the small. So when I put the hat on today, when I first got it, um, I was kind of considering the black rose fit. So when I put this on, it felt too small. Like I was walking around wearing it like this in the house. So I put it on, and right now, you know, it, it does. It feels it feels good. It's like nice cotton. It's like really a nice hat. I think it's a nice hat. Uh, it feels a little bit small, and I kind of feel a little bit like a little boy. So maybe the hat gods are telling me something. But I'm going to check out the fit. You know, it's, it's just a nice hat, you know. Uh, these hats go for about 50 bucks. When I first bought the Black Rose, uh, and you make an order, they tell you, hey, you know, give me some of your friends' email addresses and tell them that, basically tell them you should buy a hat, right? So I did that, and I did that with the Black Rose, and I did that with this hat here. I never got a discount, so I'm not sure what's going on. I am not sure what's going on. But, you know... I'll tell you something about hats, though. Everybody's head 
everybody's head is not only a different size, but it's also a different shape. And uh, these these skelly hats, they're soft, you know, they're going to, you know, conform to any shape head that is put into and everything. Now, this is a, my Western hat. This is a Wrangler. This hat fits like a glove. This is a nice hat. This is a very nice hat. I like this hat. I haven't worn this hat in a long time since I stopped wearing, having to wear cowboy boots. Um, so this hat here, uh, you can get, you can take, you can, when you buy a hat like this, you try it on and then you can have them shape it. You know, some people have a wider head this way and some don't type of thing. So they could shape it any way you want. This hat here is a seven and eighth. Ah, but yeah, this is, this is a nice hat. I just get a lot of looks with this too. Anyway. So my, my problem is that, um, well, I understand it's marketing and everything, but their brand says Boston Scally Caps. That's, that's their brand, Boston Scally Caps. That is their brand. That's what they're saying. But they're not made in Boston. They're made in China. And I don't really have a qualm about that because it's all sewn very nicely. Uh, this seam right in the front here. Lines up just right in the center of your nose, like this. So you can actually put your finger right here and feel it, and just put that right in the middle of your face like that. So I have no qualms with the quality of it, of it at all. And, um, but uh, um, some people do. Some people say, hey, if you say you're gonna, you're a Boston company, then you need to make sure that your product is made in Boston it's like the Harley Davidson's made all over the place, you know. A couple of plants here in the U.S., but you got some in India. I think there's one in China, you know, uh, UK, and it's just and they have an American flag on the on the bike. It's just, it just yeah, that's what sticks to my car right there, though. But uh, but to me, this hat right here is just a hat, you know. Uh, it's a branding situation that they're that they're going after, Boston Scally, and. Uh, I don't got a problem with that. Some people do. Anyway, this is Boston Scally. And I remember, even if you just finished a shave, it's still a good day to do another shave the next day. Something like that. Y'all take care, man. Later.